Yes, having an embedding model that allows variation in the number of dimensions of the vector space can be useful. It provides flexibility in representing and analyzing data in different ways. By adjusting the number of dimensions, you can capture varying levels of detail or abstraction in the data. For example, a higher dimensional vector space can capture more intricate relationships, while a lower dimensional space can emphasize more general patterns. This flexibility allows for better understanding and analysis of the data by accommodating different perspectives and requirements. However, it's important to find the right balance and choose the appropriate number of dimensions based on the specific task or problem at hand.